Coming up on TV Ayrshire, a mad maths teacher with a megaphone, a series of crazy mathematical challenges and a squirrel with a pie. What do they all have in common? Well, it's Pie Day of course. Hello and welcome to TV Ayrshire News, the channel that brings you the good things happening in Ayrshire. I'm your host, Scott, and today we're reporting from Rugby Park, the theatre of pies for Pie Day nonetheless. Now, I know what you're thinking, hmm, pies, sounds great, but no, it's not quite that kind of pie. Today we're celebrating mathematical pie, the formula for a circle or something like that. Kindly invited by Grange Academy teacher Mr Smith, the organiser of Pie Day in conjunction with the Kelly community. We were on hand to see lots of pie-related mathematical activities taking place and which gives young people in Kilmarnock a real-world context for mathematical application. So, nothing was stopping us, not even the rain, when we arrived at Rugby Park. So what we're going to do together, all of us, is try and create a Mexican wave which represents the Mexican pie, right? So, after a wee bit of organising, we were ready to attempt our very first Mexican pie wave. Are you ready? It's pie day. So we should really count up to three. Ready? One. Two, three! Yes! No, we have to see this again. Slow mo replay. Three! Yes! And once more, behind the scenes. Once that was done, the young people then had a chance to participate in several different activities organised by the Kelly community, including Hexagol and some amazing score-based football games. TV Ayrshire is supported by Ayrshire Film Company, who have been providing free training and real world opportunities for young people across Ayrshire for over 10 years. If you like this content and want to support us on our mission, you can buy us a coffee at ko-fi.com forward slash TV Ayrshire. Thank you. Now, while the rain maybe scuppered some of the plans, Mr Smith is not one to be beaten. Up his sleeve, he had the pie catch for his game. Try and play along and see if you can get some of them. As the day was almost over, our on the scene reporter Jack from Grange Academy caught up with some of the pupils to find out what they enjoyed. Right, can you guys please tell me your names? Uh, Harry. Thomas. Finn. Right, and what have you guys enjoyed most of it today? Uh, probably being through in the other room and getting and answering the questions on the pat, like the pythons and stuff. Like. You like the Empire biscuits? Yes. Yeah. Of course. I enjoy doing the hexagon. So I know. If I could see all of it, I would, but probably the hexagon. Well, lovely. I'm glad you enjoyed it. And with that, the day came to a close, but not before the kids got plenty of goodies, including M pie, or biscuits, from Browning's The Bakers, some badges from Maths Week Scotland, and a free copy of That's Mathematics from publishers Mama Makes Books. Finally, Jack spoke to Mr Smith to reflect on the day. Hello, Mr Smith. Happy Pie Day. Uh, thanks very much, Jack. What has been your favourite part of today? Uh, today, I think one of the things that's been brilliant is it's been a sort of joint effort. So we've had, uh, we've been working 
in Rugby Park alongside the Kelly uh, community team. We've had people from uh, the Ayrshire film crew here along working with us. We've had Pete Brownings have chipped in. They did some amazing things. They made Empire biscuits, custom made with pie, lo pie logo on it, amazing. And they made, they brought us pies and they brought us boxes, some of which are going to be used at a later date because the weather was the one thing in this team effort that didn't play along. And then um, going forward, what other ideas do you think you would have for future pie days? I, to be honest, you're not getting a world exclusive here, Jack. Nice try. Right, okay, we're going to... Uh, every year I try and come up with something new, something we've not done before. And so this year, it was all about coming to the theatre of pies and doing this today. Um, and we're going to... This is going to be the springboard for other things that we're doing with uh, Kelly, Kelly. So they're going to be doing uh, mass workshops that we're going to help develop and then they'll run in the community. But next pie day, it's far too long. It's a whole year away. But uh, I'll think of something. Don't you worry. Right, thanks very much, Mr Smith. But that was not to be the end of it. Luckily, the sun did shine again, and we were invited along to the Grange to catch up on the missed activity of calculating pi on the centre circle of the pitch. Action! <laughs> right, here we are, we're outside the Grange AstroTurf, and we have got hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of Kilmarnock pie boxes. And our plan today is to see how many of these boxes would fit around the centre circle on the Astro, and how many will fit across the way, and that's going to give us an approximation to pi. What we need to do is, oh we need to do 287 we do a times 2 equals, so, <coughs> 574. Three point one three six. Three. 3, what was that round to? Point. 3.1, 3, point one, three six, 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 one, two, two. which is, if you round it to 2, decimal places, oh, <coughs> di two dips, two decimal places, what's that? 3.14. And that completes our Pi Day video. I hope you enjoyed watching it as much as we enjoyed making it. A big thanks to Mr Smith for inviting us along to join in on Pi Day. And to the partners, Kelly Community, Browning's The Bakers, Math Week Scotland, and the publishers of That's Mathematics, Mama Makes Books for helping us make it such a successful day. Thanks for watching. Make sure and show us your support for Pi Day in the comments. Let us know what else you want to see around Ayrshire and share the video with your friends and family. Remember, you can buy us a coffee if you want to support the work we're doing to support young people in Ayrshire. See you in the next one.